Hi Pisces, welcome to your channeled messages for December 2019. I am going to be using my bells during channeling because they do help me, but I'll try to keep the volume low so it's not too distracting. I know some of you aren't crazy about the bells, but they do help me, so they're here to stay. <laughs> and you will have cards to focus on visually, so as always, my dears, I encourage you to look at each picture and see what in the picture is jumping out at you, the colors, the symbols, what it means to you while I'm channeling. So please feel free to do that and make this reading your own in that way because they are general but they are channeled messages so in we go pisces december 2019 channeled messages from spirit and the angels pisces we bring you this message for december 2019 but we ask that you understand that these labels are man-made labels and time itself is not a construct thing. Time is not concrete, we mean to say. Therefore, whenever you may stumble upon this message, it is for you. Understand and know that a door is opening, a gateway is shifting energetically at this time, Pisces, and you are coming into a time of realizing your power, your right to choose, and the fact that you do, in fact, have options. Pisces, some of you are coming out of a time in which your life has been dictated to you. You have been told what to think or how you should feel or how you should be. Uh, you've been told you are too sensitive. You have been told that maybe you are even too demanding or unrealistic or that you're wanting it all in some way. And you've been told how you should be or what you should do. Pisces, your eyes will be opening very soon. And that you are going to begin to see that you do have options available to you. And that there are different paths or different ways that you can go about achieving the things that you are hoping for. Or the things that you desire to have in your life. As you're coming into this newfound confidence, you are also realizing that a lot of the things you were told were... Uh, undesirable per se within yourselves are actually strengths or gifts that are going to help you move forward in a way that is natural to you in a way that feels right to you and in a way that is bringing you the success that you desire and when we say success Pisces understand success comes in many ways and in many forms Many humans hear success and immediately their mind goes towards finances or money. Understand and know this is a part of the abundance that you will be receiving, but success goes so much further. Success is fulfillment. Success is knowledge. Success is wisdom. Success is love. Success is feeling accomplished. And you will find ways in which you are going to be accomplishing goals that before you never thought possible because you were so used to hearing what was and wasn't possible or what you can and can't do what you are and are not capable of but you are realizing now that these rules these labels they're not true and they don't apply to you in this way and you will be making choices you will be making decisions understand and know those of you who have been avoiding choices or decisions will find that circumstances are changing in which you are being made to make a choice you are being made to make a decision this is not being done to you to cause you intentional discomfort uh, as a punishment but more so to get you in the habit to make you realize this is the time for you to create you you are going to be co-creating with the universe beginning in December in through the next few months for many of you. Pisces, so many of you have been afraid to make decisions or choices because you've questioned and your wisdom. And much of this has been because you've been told that you are not wise or you were told that you do not make good decisions. And 
In the past, you've made decisions, some of which you regret till this day. This is a normal part of human behavior. This is a normal part of the human experience, Pisces. All of your brothers and sisters on this planet have experienced this, regardless of age, regardless of background, regardless of zodiac sign. A part of the human experience is to make decisions. And in hindsight, we may look back and say, whoa, this was not so good for me to do. But this is where wisdom comes in. Wisdom is not something that individuals are born with. Wisdom is something that individuals grow into over time. This is why old, old age and elderly age is sometimes associated with wisdom because these are individuals who have lived a life they've made decisions they've made mistakes this is what true wisdom is wisdom is learning from experience learning from the past so you are not someone who makes bad decisions my dears you are someone who is wise as long as you learn from those previous decisions and that you place them as you would tools in a toolbox so that as you move forward in the future, you will make better decisions because past experience has taught you what does and does not work. You are not someone who makes bad decisions. You are someone who is wiser. You are wiser because of the past understand and know this pisces those of you who are individuals who have the practice of working with cards you know, spirit is available for you to connect to at any time cards are simply just a tool or a stepping stone but those of you who feel drawn towards the cards we encourage you to perhaps maybe set up the emperor card or the empress card and have this somewhere where you can see it each day and spend some time looking at it and envisioning yourself sitting in that seat or in that throne understanding and knowing that it is your experience that is bringing you into power it is your experience that is bringing you into success you are learning from the past this is where your success begins to set in for you as you move into the future Pisces you are all connected with the element of water you are connected with the element of the moon you are intuitive and in this sense you have luck or good fortune as it were that you are born with a stronger ability to access a universal wisdom through intuition through an inner knowing and Pisces, many of you in the past, even when you've made decisions that you later regretted, you have said to yourself many times, oh, I knew, I knew I shouldn't have done that, or I knew I should have done that, whatever it may be. Many of you have, as you say, the expression goes, kicked yourselves for steps that you took or decisions that you made because you felt that you should not have done that certain thing. You are intuitive. If you learn to trust that intuition, if you learn to trust that instinct, coupled with this wisdom that you are gaining, you will be very successful in your plans and goals and desires. Pisces, so many of you have not been taken seriously because you have been seen as childlike or naive or or pure or innocent and understand this darlings that many of you are what some individuals some spiritual teachers on this earth realm refer to as earth angels or light workers and so because you are connected with this light you may appear to be to some as naive or innocent or or childlike but this is a sense of your purity this is a sense of your connection to the higher vibration because you are not being edited you are not being 
influenced, you are not being molded and shaped by lower vibrational things such as ego, uh, such as uh, materialism, such as um, lusting or lustiness or, or things like this. And so you might be seen as someone who is not established or strong or... Uh, in control in, in, in these worldly kinds of ways. But really, these are unnecessary distractions. And so do not allow people to make you judge yourself or to see yourself as someone who's not successful or not experienced or not in control or not grown up enough in some way because you are exactly as you are meant to be and you are coming into a higher vibration into things that are more meaningful uh, more connected more emotionally rewarding you do not need to be some some uh, some kind of ego driven uh, person or or someone that uh, is deemed successful in the ways that ego sees success. It's so very irrelevant that we are confident and we look forward to the time, Pisces, that many of you will understand more clearly what we are saying to you in this message and you will laugh. You will be able to look back and laugh at the silliness of the way that success has been presented to you or the way that you were measured and you will realize that you were right all along. It's not you that needs to be uh, less sensitive or uh, more worldly or whatever it may be. You will understand this message soon and we look forward to the joy that you will be experiencing at that time and understand and know that we will be rejoicing with you in spirit all around you even if you do not realize or sense us at that time. Pisces, as you move along this path, you are going to be experiencing moments of success. They are going to bring you a great deal of joy and you are going to feel so happy that things are beginning to shift and move forward. But these moments of success are going to have in between them periods of pause, periods of break. And it may feel to you like these are coming across as some kind of lull, some kind of lull in between. Some of you are saying hanged man. Understand and know this, this is temporary. And these moments in between are not happening because you're being punished or because your prayers aren't being answered or because you're unlucky in some way. These lulls in between are being given to you as gifts, Pisces, because as you have these moments of success, you are breaking away from generational teachings, generational attachments, generational curses. Uh, you are cleansing and clearing yourself from uh childhood experiences and you're learning to trust in yourself and this is a massive release that you are experiencing so for this reason you are going to need time in between to rest to release to to let go and we do not wish to bombard you with too much too soon otherwise it will be very possible to undo the success that you're coming into much like if you were to water a plant water is wonderful for plants water keeps plants alive but if you were to go ahead and dump an entire canister of water onto some potted plant it would kill it it would be too much too much too soon so understand and know that you are being watered like this plant and we are allowing the change and the good to come in at an appropriate rate of which can be absorbed. We are allowing you to absorb and grow before the next shower, before the next blessing that comes in for you. So be patient and understand and know that you are growing as you are receiving and we want to give you time to, to pace this out. 
This is necessary to ensure that this growth will be a permanent one, that this success will be a permanent one, that it will not be overwhelming for you. Be patient with yourself, be realistic, be reasonable, and understand and know that things are shifting. Shifting for the better, Pisces. It is in this time in between when things may appear to not be moving as quickly that you are being asked to work and strengthen your intuition. We touched on intuition, Pisces, and many of you say, oh, but how, how can I do this? The answer is through listening. How do you listen? You listen by sitting in the silence. Make time to sit in the quiet. And to check in with yourself, Pisces. Check in with what you're feeling in your body. Listen to what your body is telling you. Are you being asked to get more sleep? Are you being asked to avoid certain foods? Are you being asked to get more exercise? Are you being asked to spend more time in natural light, away from artificial light, or away from being cooped up in side artificial buildings are you being asked to spend time in nature are you being asked to dance are you hungering for something uh, whether it be food or something different something to feed the soul as you take those steps you will begin to receive your messages you will find that you are aligning with spirit you will find that you are aligning mind body and soul with guidance from above and with a strengthened sense of intuition that compass that is directing you towards the next steps to take then it all becomes so automatic this is how the lulls or the pauses in between will be less because you will learn to listen. You will be in the natural flow and you'll be taking those steps quite automatically and this causes things to move ahead more effortlessly, less delayed. With some patience and some perseverance, you will find yourself coming into independence coming into success coming into understanding how to make your natural state of being your natural personality work for you instead of working against it trying to step into someone else's version of success darling pisces we thank you for receiving <laughs>